Now it's time to press buttons and talk with Mickey and Brosy D. I sense a very shady reason for such a bizarre action. I was a very bad boy. And who better to ask for that reason than King Primadux himself? Don't call me that bitch. I see. Ambassador will be examining that statue now, with or without your permission. Did you hear me? Me, 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 me. Okay, me, I guess we'll look at it. Uh, let's take a look. Me, oh, there's a... Well, we saw that Oh, that's, that's new. Or, that's old. Look at the head. The head of the statue? Hmm. This hi, I've just been kind of quietly twiddling my thumbs this whole time. This guy kind of looks like the Steel Samurai, don't you think? Maybe it's because they look alike they just picked to be the Goodwill Ambassador. I suppose that's possible. Hmm? Take a look at this area around the base of his neck. It looks like a gap. Hey, you're right. Maybe it's meant to be some kind of secret. Perhaps it's possible to open the statue from this gap in its construction. Like a Pez dispenser. What? What's Pez? Hurry up and open it, Miles. I want some Pez. What's Pez? All right, here goes. Oh, boy. What's Pez? I love Pez. Hey, what's Pez? Wow. Pez? Pez? It really did open up, and there is a big Pez inside. That's not Pez. Pez for everybody. Do you know what Pez is? This. No, it's not. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> Never mind. I guess it's not. Hey, what's this thing that fell out? What it's is not, Pez? It's not Pez. I not believe this. a more thorough examination of it is required. Now I wonder what Pez is, too. I thought this was what it was. What in the... It's not Pez. Is this... Hey, what's Pez? Okay, whatever. Is this what I think it is? It's a plate for making counterfeit bills. Somehow it appears that we've at long last arrived. I can dispense Pez. At the... Maybe <laughs> <laughs> swallows him up. Uh, Wait, you can watch him both through... Hold on, give me, give okay. me a second. Oh. At the exit to this complex labyrinth. That's a Pez. We finally hold within our hands one of the counterfeit money plates. And the reason why the replica was smuggled into Alabas to begin with. Oh. Well. Cool plates. Cool plates. The Primadux statue can only be handled by the ambassador or the secretariat. <laughs> and the replica is nothing more than a hollow shell covered in gold. So ominous. These two circumstances make the statue the ideal object in which to hide contraband. After receiving the statue containing the counterfeit plate from Sheena, the ambassador had the misfortune of accidentally running into Damask II. What, who the hell are you? What the hell? What the Surprised by this? the thief, the ambassador raised the replica statue at Damask II and... Yes, yeah, so this guy was just like, Hello! I'm here to... Ow! Oh my god, I'm gonna kill you! Then, in order to frame the steel samurai of the murder, he covered the samurai sword in blood. Well, Ambassador Alba, <laughs> You're the leader of the smuggling ring? My country is a mess, and it's all because of you? You're the one who killed the master second? Sorry, I've realized we had, it I were inside, I, got I should use an inside a voice. A little excited, I'm just a little fired up because I was accused of murder, which was completely implausible. Answer us! <laughs> I never thought, I never thought that you would figure things out to this level. Huh. However, there is one point I disagree with you on. The head of the smuggling ring was... Mr. Cochin. Not so fast. Quit screw... Quite screwing around. Quite screwing around, you are. Quite screwing around, you are. I have no sympathy for someone who would try to pass the guilt onto a dead man. If there is one thing I'm sure of, it's that you're the real ringleader, Quirkus Alba. It's not good to speak with such subjectivity, you know, Agent Lang. Subjectivity? My conclusion is anything but, and is the result of logic and investigation. Logic and investigation. Only seconds ago, you were ready to arrest Ms. Von Karma for yeah. basically no fucking reason. Yeah, you're not wrong. I don't think we can give such flip-floppy logic any real weight, do you? <laughs> and, uh, 
<laughs> Shit. He can't think of anything else to do. He's just like, I'll just... Well, the hell's wrong with you? What the hell's wrong with you? It looks like you still don't get, but it's what I thought. Don't get why I came back. Excuse me? You see, the reason I came back... ...is so that I could sink my fangs into your wrinkly old neck. It's very fragile, don't From do that. From the very beginning, my real target has been you. What? Agent Lang, I demand an explanation. This is juicy. Sorry, sis. I didn't mean to put you through all that. I knew you were innocent from the very beginning. You did? I knew that this whole incident had been meticulously planned and prepared for. So naturally, the occupant of this room, Ambassador Alba, seemed the most suspicious. But without the Ambassador's permission, we couldn't get in and take another look- we couldn't get in to take another look around. Ah, so that's why you put on this big show to accuse Francisco of the murder. I'd be upset if, like, the killer I'd been chasing my whole life was, like, like, it came to this silly, like, MacGyver-ass fucking science experiment case. Yeah. Using Francisca as the bait, you were able to gain us entry and investigative rights. Yeah, if I hadn't done that, I doubt the ambassador would have given the okay to poke around. So that's what all this was about. Very well, I will forgive you. Still BFFs? Still be- I'll add you back on Facebook, fine. Hey now. You're a rock star, uh, but classic. in exchange for using me as bait, Edgeworth isn't allowed to sing it. Okay, you can sing it if you want. Gumshoe, you can sing it too. Get Anyone? game on! Go play! Hey now. No! No, 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 no Mr. No. Edgeworth, you said you couldn't sing it! Shut oh, up! Damn it. You will take some responsibility and help us find the truth. Agent Lang, for giving me such a great opening. I thank you. Oh, that cleaners is gone. <laughs> You're not allowed to say it either. <laughs> you know, I just knew, Mr. Prosecutor, that somehow if we were able to find some proof by investigating this room, that you would be able to figure out the real culprit with your special brand of logic. Huh. The evidence detectives collect combined with the logic of a prosecutor. That's just as it should be in a prosecutor detective team, right? Detectives can apply logic, too. I don't know about all that, Baka. But one thing I do know is that I'm itching to see that old man get what's coming to him. Ho, ho. I'm Santa now. You, you wouldn't arrest Santa Claus, would you? That's all I had. <laughs> you wouldn't arrest Santa Claus, would you? What about the children? Who's going to deliver the presents? You're not Santa Claus. Damn it. Oh, <laughs> Damn, oh, oh piss. Piss. <laughs> You're quite scary when you want to oh, be, on not you? Christmas. Hey, you were the one who were pl was planning to use me to push all the guilt onto the sis. I've got a few more costumes to try. But unfortunately for you, you misjudged me. I'm Look, I have the Ten Commandments. I'm Moses. <laughs> you wouldn't put Moses in jail, would you? It's me, Gandalf the White, your favorite Lord of the Ring. You're not going to send him to jail, are you? I don't like Gandalf the White. I'm, I'm not Gandalf the Grey. Gandalf the Grey or Saruman, whoever the fuck. You think I'd like Saruman? No. I don't know. He's cool. Obviously, my favorite character is Pippin. That's Duh. me, Pippin. The, That's me. Oh, no, no, I don't have a Pippin. Oh, piss at Christmas. Agent Lang, I wish for you to stop trying to intimidate me. What we need right now is evidence and proof. I wonder if you have what is necessary to prove that I am the head of the smuggling ring. Objection! Objection. Don't be such a sore loser. If you're really, if you really are the head of the smuggling ring, then you should acknowledge your crimes with dignity. Dignity? That is nothing more than a fool's insincere display of strength. If you really wish for me to acknowledge my crimes, then I would like to first see some of this thing you call evidence. Ugh. I tell you, I knew nothing, really. I didn't even know that a counterfeit plate was hidden inside that statue. Objection! You swapped a real statue that vested in your country the authority to rule for a fake. <clears throat> it doesn't make any sense that you didn't know anything. It doesn't make sense? Why doesn't it make sense? 
Can you prove that it doesn't make sense? Ugh. He's really got us. When, when people ask us to prove things, it really puts a wrench in the works. He turns the entire situation around against us. All I did was say, do you have proof? That's really easy to do. The proof that Interpol has been after which points to this man as the ringleader. If we can somehow find that proof now, and we can see to it that justice is finally served, is there nothing I can use to break this case wide open? Huh. Remember that? Huh. Rem remember them? The trump card and the videotape. With those two items, we might be able to finally bring this man down. But the card is evidence from a case that Mr. Faraday hid away in secret. And the tape was stolen by Detective Bad from the police. They're both illegal evidence. Wow. No matter what, a protector of the law can't be allowed to use such pieces of evidence. It might be the slowest one yet. Yeah, that was pretty bad. Needless to say, we Von Karmas are commanded to achieve nothing but victory. And by any means necessary. The only way to bring someone like that to justice was to do so outside of the courts. That's what we thought at the time. I no longer follow the path of Manfred von Karma. This is getting too scary. And I won't follow the path of the Atagarasu. You're all gone now. This leaves me with what? What creed will I believe in? If I want to pursue the truth, then I will sully my hands in illeg illegality. Whoa. And if I want to pursue justice, then I will lose the truth. What is the law? And what is justice? And which path is a, is a prosecutor supposed to follow? That choice is one I must make by my own hand here and now. I feel like they probably wouldn't want us to use it just yet. Yeah. Or... Hmm. Mm, that's a tricky question. The easy Should way. I use the trump card or don't use the trump card? Mm. But it's illegal. Let's say no. No, let's just do justice. I'm a prosecutor, and I can't allow myself to use evidence such as these. Mr. Edgeworth, if you don't do something, Ambassador Alba's gonna get away with it. <sighs> I know, but... Objection! Objection! <laughs> what are you holding back for? The only thing Yvonne Karma should pursue is the perfect proof. If you really don't have what it takes to complete our argument... I, I do have it, actually. Then there is absolutely no reason not to use it. <sighs> actually, it's my investigation. I can... I not so fast! I'm not doing it. Lang Z says, The reason people judge people is because people are people. Okay. People weren't born to be chained to the law. Laws were born to protect the people. You're the only one here right now who can put this guy out to pasture. And that is the only way a second or a third generation of Zhang Fa's people will be born. I wish I'd be put out to pasture. Can you really still hesitate knowing the fate of a nation rests in your hands? I'd eat grass all day. Mm. I... There is no limit to the law. Any limit that exists was set there by man. I'd be like a little cow, man. Stop talking about eating grass, you imbecile. When a person goes beyond that limit, then the law, too, crosses into new territory. For what reason were laws invented? The answer to that is what I must now show. Damn, Edgeworth. Ambassador Alba, I wonder if you might recognize this. Hmm. Oh, I wonder what that card is. I I've, definitely didn't I've react. I've never seen that before in my life. It's a directives card used by the leader of the ring to relay instructions to his subordinates. I fucking know that. I mean, I don't know. Oh, is that what it is? I've never... I don't know. This card was sent to the real culprit behind the KG-8 incident ten years ago. A man by the name of Mr. Manny Cochin. Oh. So why do you have such a card in your possession? Are you going to run a smuggling ring? Because it was hand-delivered to me. By a certain great thief. The Yatagarasu. The Yatagarasu gave that to you? Don't talk nonsense and let's be serious, Mr. Edgeworth. The Yatagarasu is just a cartoon character. Do you no have one's ever said he was a cartoon character. Well, I don't fucking know. I'm old. Do you have any proof that the card contains... Anything I don't know, I just assume is a I cartoon character. They're all cartoons to me, right? 
I don't know. The card contains directions from the ringleader. Billy Eilish? Is that a cartoon character? I'll have you know that the card is not the only thing I was given. What is this, cartoons? This contains security footage. Well, it does have some animaniacs on it, but we fast forward through that part. That was shot just before the start of the KG-8 incident. <coughs> the KG-8 incident? The card and the video. These two pieces of evidence are what will seal your fate. Maybe next time we'll seal his fate. Maybe. In a, maybe. In one swift episode. I think it'll be just one it'll, more episode. Just take one little episode. And that's all it'll take. We'll just knock him down and go home.